गुड मॉर्निंग टू वन अंडा इन दिस सेशन वी गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट हिंदू अरबिक सिस्टम ऑल यू नो इन दिस सिस्टम यू हैव टू यूज ओनली टेन सिंबल्स दैट सिंबल्स नथिंग बट ये डिजिट्स दैट्स ये जीरो वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन दिस ऑल डिजिट्स यूज इन ये हिंदू अरबिक सिस्टम इन दिस सिस्टम टोटल नंबर्स डिवाइडेड इनटू सम पीरियड्स अंडे पार्ट पार्ट का डिवाइड चेस करो दैट इस पीरियड्स द फर्स्ट पीरियड विल बी हंड्रेड्स सेकंड वन थाउजेंड्स थर्ड वन लैक्स फोर्थ वन क्रोस नाउ हियर हंड्रेड्स मींस हंड्रेड पीरियड मींस हियर हंड्रेड्स प्लस टेंस प्लस वन्स so these three digits nothing but ye yeah, hundreds next one thousand thousand means thousands and ten thousand belongs to thousand periods next one lakhs and ten lakhs belongs to lakhs period and crores and ten crores belongs to crores period the separation of a periods first one is crores comma lakhs next one is lakhs next one thousands next one Hundreds. Hundred means hundreds plus tens plus ones. So it is hundred period, thousand periods, lakhs period, and crores period. Suppose take for example five seven nine four two eight six nine five. Now in this Hindu Arabic system, separate the digits by using the periods. First one is hundred period. Means separate these three numbers. Next one thousand periods. Next one lakhs period. Next one crores period. That's why first of all take first three digits, two digits, two digits, and two digits. Now how to read this number? Fifty-seven crores, ninety-four lakhs, twenty-eight thousands, six hundred ninety-five. So this is a Hindu Arabic system. Now take one more example: five, three, four, seven, zero, nine, eight, four. This total number separated by a periods. First one three, so hundred period. Next one thousand. Next one lakhs. Next one is a crores. That's why here five crores, thirty four lakhs, seventy thousand. Nine hundred eighty-four. So in the Hindu Arabic system, you have to read by using crores, lakhs, thousands, and hundreds, tens, and ones. That's why in the Hindu Arabic system, separated by the periods. First of all, three numbers. Next one two. Next one two. Next one two. So separated by the commas. First of all three. Next two. Next two. Next two, and so on. So this is a Hindu Arabic system. Now take one example. Write this number separating periods in Hindu Arabic system. Or you know, in Hindu Arabic system, first of all separate three periods from right to left. Three, next one two, next one two. First period hundreds, thousands, lakhs, crores. So here seven crores, fifty six lakhs, twenty four thousand nine hundred eight. Now take one more example. This one also separating the periods. First of all, three digits. Next one, two digits. Next one, two digits. It is hundreds, thousands, lakhs, and crores. Eighty-five crores, thirty-one lakhs, seventy-two thousand sixty-nine. So this is a Hindu Arabic system. Now check expanded form in Hindu Arabic system. Suppose here fifteen thousand seven hundred sixty-eight. Now write the expanded form: ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands. That's it is fifteen thousand. So one into that is ten thousands. One into ten thousand plus five into thousand. Five into thousand plus seven into hundred plus six into ten. Plus eight into one. That's why ones multiplying with one, tens multiplying with ten, sevens multiplying with it is hundreds multiplying with hundreds. It is thousands. That's why multiplying with thousand. It is ten thousand place. That's why multiplying with ten thousand. Now it is one into ten thousand 
टेन थाउजेंड प्लस थ्री फाइव थाउजेंड प्लस सेवन हंड्रेड प्लस सिक्सटी प्लस एट सो दिस इज एक्सपेंडेड फॉर्म नाउ टेक वन मोर एग्जाम्पल सिक्सटी फाइव लैक्स थर्टी सेवन थाउजेंड फोर हंड्रेड नाइन सो सिक्सटी फाइव लैक्स मीन्स सिक्स इंटू अदरवाइज राइट सिक्स इंटू हाउ मेन डिजिट वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स दट इज सिक्सटी लैक्स प्लस यूर फाइव लैक्स दट फाइव इंटू वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव जीरो वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव जीरो प्लस थ्री इंटू हाउ मेनी जीरो वन टू थ्री फोर वन टू थ्री फोर दट इज थर्टी थाउजेंड नेक्स्ट वन सेवन इंटू हाउ मेनी जीरो थ्री जीरो वन टू थ्री सेवन थाउजेंड नेक्स्ट वन फोर हंड्रेड फोर इंटू टू जीरो जीरो इंटू टेन मीन जीरो नो नीड टू रईट नेक्स्ट वन नईन इंटू वन मीन नईन सो दिस वन सो एक्सपैंड फॉर्म ऑफ दिस स्टैंडर्ड नंबर नौ हिस्सा राइट इन एन न्यूमरिकल फॉर्म आर स्टैंडर्ड फॉर्म सिक्स इंटू टेन थाउजेंड टू इंटू थाउजेंड फाइव इंटू हंड्रेड प्लस एट इंटू टेन प्लस फोर इंटू वन सो सिक्स इंटू टेन थाउजेंड मीन सिक्सटी थाउजेंड सिक्सटी थाउजेंड प्लस टू इंटू थाउजेंड मीन टू थाउजेंड प्लस फाइव इंटू हंड्रेड मीन फाइव हंड्रेड प्लस एट इंटू टेन मीन एटी प्लस फोर नो एड ऑल नंबर सिक्सटी थाउजेंड प्लस टू सिक्सटी टू थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड एटी फोर दट सिक्सटी टू थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड एटी फोर सो दिस इज ए न्यूमरिकल फॉर्म दिस वन इज ए एक्सपैंडेड फॉर्म ऑफ ए दिस नंबर फ्रेंड्स नाउ चेक वैल्यू ऑफ ए नंबर सो एवरी नंबर कंटेन टू वैल्यूज फर्स्ट वन इज फेस वैल्यू और सेकेंड वन इज प्लेस वैल्यू फेस वैल्यू मीन्स remains as it is same where it is a number so number ekkada unna sare manaku anavasaram that number matru face value eppudu change avadu mana face value ni entante 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 these are face values untayi ante mana face value unte 0 nunchi 9 varaku edo oka number ku oka face value undi aa place lo ki change avadu ante 9 ki more than undadu anamata The face value of a number is always less than ten. And a ten can't occur on that. So always more than zero. Zero can occur on that. Less than that equal to zero. But in the case of place value, it is depending on the place occurring the number in a given digit. Suppose take three hundred fifty-seven. Take three hundred fifty-seven. Now write the Face value and place value of a number, but here the face value of a number is always five. So the face value never change. So if the face value mere ga near ga na oru matchilo, our face value puru kora five hai ontadi. But according to place, the place value will be changed. The five is in the place tens. That's why the value of the place value of five here fifty. Suppose take five hundred ninety-four. Now, what is the place value? The five is in the place of hundred. That's why the place value of five will be five hundred. So five into hundred. That is a place value. Suppose take three four five. Now three hundred forty-five. What is the place value of five? A yeah, five is in units place. That's why the value of the place of a five will be only five. Five into one means only five. So in this case, the value of the place value and face value both are equal. For example, take three hundred twenty-five. In the three hundred twenty-five, what is the face value of two? Two will be two only. So never change. But what is the place value of two in this place? Means the two is in tens place. That's why the place value of a two will be twenty. Two into ten equal twenty. But here. The difference between the difference between face value and place value of a two in the number three hundred twenty-five. Now face value, face value will be two. So what is the place value of two here? Twenty. So difference means greatest number minus smallest number. So twenty minus two equal to eighteen. So here the difference between the face value and the place value. 
of 2 in the number 325 is 18. Friends, now check successor of a number and predecessor of a number. Successor means if you add 1 to a given number, we get the next number. That next number will be the successor of a given number. Suppose take 99. What is the successor of 99? Successor is the one mundi galta angada. And the that is plus add 1. Successor. So add 1. So 99 plus 1 means 100. The 100 is a successor of a given number. Suppose take 999. What is the successor of 999 plus 1? Means that is 1000. So the successor of a 999 will be 1000. Suppose the successor of 8942. So 8942. What is the successor? Means add 1. That is 8943. That is the successor. Successor means add 1. Simply 1 access to which answer is given number. Successor out matter. Next one, predecessor. Predecessor means 1 less than the given number. Suppose 5374. What is the predecessor of? 5374 means minus 1. So minus 1 means 5374 minus 1 means 3. So 5373 will be the predecessor of 5374. Predecessor means minus 1. Suppose take 100. So what is the predecessor of 100? Means 100 minus 1 equal to 99. So simply predecessor means minus 1. Success means plus 1. Now, what is the successor of x? Means x plus 1. What is the successor of a? a plus 1. What is the predecessor of a? a minus 1. What is the predecessor of x? x minus 1. That's why success means add 1, predecessor means subtract 1. Friends, now suppose what is the predecessor of 2 in the set of natural numbers and 1 rasta. But what is a predecessor of 1 in the set of natural numbers? There is no predecessor in the set of natural numbers after 1. 1 is a predecessor. Because minus 1 is 0. 0 is not. That's why the predecessor of 1 in the set of natural numbers is not defined. Similarly, the predecessor of 1 in the set of whole numbers means 0. So, if you have 0, the whole numbers are right. The set of natural numbers are predecessor of 1 means not defined. But in the case of whole numbers, what is the predecessor of 0? Predecessor of 0 means not defined. Because 0 before number is not 0 minus 1, 0 minus 1 is minus 1. Minus 1 is not defined. That's it. Now, Z. What is the predecessor of minus 2 and minus 1? Because minus 1 is not minus 3. What is the predecessor of minus in the set of integers and minus 4? And can you not do that? So, what is the predecessor of 1 in the set of integers means? 1 minus 0, 0. What is the predecessor of 0 in the set of integers means minus 1. So what is the successor of minus 3 in the set of integers? So means plus 1. Minus 3 plus 1 means minus 2. So that is the successor of minus 3 in the set of integers. Suppose minus 107 is given. What is the successor of minus 107 in the set of integers? Plus 1. That's your right, add 1. So, minus 107 plus 1 means minus 106. Now, what is the predecessor of suppose minus 100? So, what is the predecessor of minus 100 means minus 1. Minus 100 before number minus minus 101 be the predecessor of minus 100 in the set of integers.